My name is Oliver Barnett from the London Clinic of Nutrition and today I was going to talk to you about um, what is functional medicine and what it means to us here at the clinic. Functional medicine was originally set up by an institute in America to treat medical doctors how to practice integrated medicine in a very short course of say 15 to 18 days. Whereas in the UK a lot of the nutritional therapists had already been using functional medicine in an integrative way for, for many, many years based on a three-year course of study. So experiencing functional medicine, I think, in the UK is a far better uh, often experience than it is necessarily in the US. And working with someone who is nutrition trained or herbal medicine trained or naturopathy trained alongside using the functional medicine model patients are going to be far better off with that experience. And so functional medicine is effectively a form of modern day naturopathy or integrated medicine. Understanding the why a patient has reached a place where they are not whole or unwell or experiencing disease or illness. Whereas conventional medicine tends to use an acute care model to try and treat disease or, or chronic illness. So, but what we find is that acute care model can't be used to treat chronic conditions. That acute care model might well be um, using drug A to treat problem B or using surgery, but that can't really be used for chronic health problems. And that's why we find ourselves in a existence now where the mortality rate is sort of remained pretty much the same but the morbidity rate is massively increasing. So when people get to the stage where they're getting their, in the, their last 15 or 20 years of their life, they're not living out particularly great days because there's so much morbidity and so much disease. And now obviously we have things on the increase such as um, Alzheimer's and dementia and Alzheimer's now being called diabetes type three, partly because of the type of westernized diets that, that, that we're eating. So, with functional medicine, we take a very detailed case history of patients' past um, antecedents, which is the things that have gone on in their health history in the past, and triggers that have contributed to their health, and take a very integrated and holistic view. And that's done partly by doing very detailed case histories of patients, normally involving intake forms and long um, discussions about the patient's health journey. So our initial consultations tend to be about an hour and a half in length, whereby during that, 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 that intake, we can then develop a really robust treatment plan with the patient to get them back to being well again. Also within functional medicine is the testing that we use. So we use testing that looks at um, often metabolites of various systems in the body, but also looks at um, different aspects of a patient's health from detoxification to looking at energy systems sort of, such as mitochondrial health or looking at the gut microbiome which is really important via different stool testing uh, and also looking at genetic testing as well. And within functional medicine we're also looking at the emotional and spiritual and mental health aspects of the patient and this is incredibly important. How much, how much sleep does the patient get? What is the quality of that sleep? Are they waking up feeling refreshed? And why is that? Are they eating close to bed? And what are their relationships like in their life? What is the patient's sense of community? Does the patient have a real sense of community? What is their tribe? What is their purpose? And are they living with purpose? All these questions are incredibly important um, to making up someone's overall wellness. And the, the sad thing is, is that, especially when I notice when I go and give talks at companies, one of the questions I ask is who feels like they're in optimal wellness? And 90% of people don't. But the, the good news is, is that it's not difficult to be in optimal wellness given the right um, lifestyle choices. And functional medicine is, for me, what it means to me is very much about um, lifestyle medicine. And some of the things I mentioned a minute ago, um, about how people are leaving their lives, how much time are they having for um, compassion, gratitude, uh, leisure time, um, how much time are they having in their lives for exercise, movement, 
all that stuff is actually as important, if not more important, than, say, diets and supplementation and herbal medicine, let's say. Um, so I hope this gives you a bit of a, a taste of the type of um, wellness work that I and, we, and what we practice at the clinic with patients and my own interpretation and vision of what functional medicine means to me. Thank you.